I knew I always wanted to be in the field of media growing up, like watching the news. I'm like, this is what I want to do. This is what I want to be in life. I don't know. It was just so fascinating to me, like documentaries and stuff like that. It was just like, wow, how are they going to tell this story? How are they going to tell something about this person? I was looking for an after school program on After School Matters. Um, so I typed in media and FSM popped up. And then I got a call saying, okay, we want you for an interview. So she asked me like, what were my interests and stuff like that. And a few months prior to that, I had a cousin who was shot and killed. Um, and in the media, they were like, you know, like basically trying to say that he was something that he was not. So I'm like, I want to be that person who you know, sex the record straight. So I'm like, and I told Rachel, and she was like, okay, here, we're gonna help you do that. Okay, you ready, It's just a, just a rehearsal, just a rehearsal. Earlier? On Thursday, the entire crew will be working together to film the gentrification narrative. You all are going to have different roles that day. Rachel and Dan, like, they taught me how to edit my pieces and voiceovers and cameras. I really got the feel of what a true journalist is. Reporter for FSM News, I am Brittany Martin. Prison is like the new form of slavery. Um, especially with laws tailored to people of color for drugs and other, um, you know, illegal substances. The package was basically about the 13th Amendment and how slavery still exists in the prison system in America. I had to, like, try to understand, like, where the interviewee was coming from, and I had to, like, go and find people who were willing to talk about, you know, being formally incarcerated. So it forced me to like go and like just try to persuade people like, hey, you know, your story can change somebody's life. Personally, before I came to FSM, I didn't have people skills. That's something that's not generally taught in school. But when you come here, you have to know how to communicate. So people skills is very important in any minority communities because People, they don't really take the time out to see who we are and what we're capable of. Ever since then, I've been producing stories about social justice and African-American communities. Here, I feel like I'm a leader in this space. I help the new recruits that comes in through FSM. Um, I pretty much became the person that I plan to become for the rest of my life. I plan to have my own media channel. I want to have my own news outlet, diverse media. Because it's just like, how can we tell news effectively if it's only being told from one side of the you know, story? <laughs>